Children grow very quickly, and when they outgrow their rear-facing seats, they should graduate to forward-facing ones. But they should ride rear-facing as long as possible. They just can't be too heavy or too tall for the car seat. Some convertible seats have rear-facing limits of 40 pounds or higher. Forward-facing seats, when used properly, provide excellent protection for older children who have exceeded the height and weight limit of their rear-facing seats. In a crash, an unrestrained child would slam into the vehicle interior. Just like rear-facing seats, use a forward-facing one in the back seat, the safest place for all children. When installing the seat, follow the instructions that come with your seat and your vehicle owner's manual. That way, you'll be sure the seat is properly installed using the latch attachments or the vehicle's belt system. The seat should be positioned upright and securely attached to the vehicle. All forward-facing seats have a top tether and you should be sure to use it whether you're using the lower latch anchors or securing the seat with the vehicle's belts. When buckling your child in, make sure the harness straps are at or above shoulder level. Fasten the straps so the harness is snug and flat against the body. The retainer clip, which holds the straps together, should be at armpit level. Make sure you can't pinch the strap at the shoulder once the harness is buckled and tightened. As your child grows, you'll need to adjust for a proper fit so you can keep your child in the harness as long as the seat allows. Some forward-facing seats have weight limits only up to 40 pounds, but many seats now go up to 65 and even 100 pounds. Check your vehicle owner's manual to determine if latch can be used at these higher weight limits. Remember, the safest place for your growing child is in a tightly secured, forward-facing child seat in the back seat of your vehicle.